straight. Daddy! Oh, sweetheart. I'm glad you're home. Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, your goodness. <laughs> Knew it couldn't be that bad. No way. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> Damn, we are good! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And uh. one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. Uh. <laughs> After he leads the charge. You on, uh, you've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. To <laughs> worry. So we had theorized earlier that uh, she was the one that put us in touch with each other. Can we better go back on here. No. Are you sure you haven't seen them? people here taking? You see them here? And it seems like we have quite the uh, quite the history. All sorts of people here. Maz Soft Drinks. <laughs> now there's a catchy name. If I ever heard one. Everybody is just like... Everyone at their own personal water cooler. And then they see somebody like us strolling through, and it's like, got to be intimidating. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco-warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down, and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> Jeez. What the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. They're back. You again. We follow them? That seems safe. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? <laughs> She's being pretty hard on herself. Yeah, welcome to the slums. Sector 7. What the? Oh, the president's name is Shinra too. No freaking way! President Shinra. Fire out, idiots! I was there yesterday. I mean, to be fair, I don't think it's a big secret that it was us. They're seventh heaven. Remember the last time I saw a real one? 
remember what she said too, how this was these were traditionally given to like When did you get so thoughtful? When you return to a lost love? It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, so at some point plays blew up. Everyone on TV's talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? huh. So at some point, um, I don't know if we had like a relationship or just a friendship or whatever, but then we went off to join the army, for lack of a better word, and didn't look back. Uh. Hey! What the hell do you think you're doing scaring my dog? Well, I'm just like, like I was just gonna say hi. What? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> Daddy's right. That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good <laughs> girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still <laughs> waiting on it. Uh, right. Awkward. About that. We should talk. Uh, outside. what do you mean, about that? <sighs> Barrett? Barrett? Um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Let that be a lesson to you. When you want to talk to a little kid, don't go give <laughs> another professional killer eyes. Right. Okay. Use a jukebox to play your favorite tunes. You can add more music to the jukebox by collecting music discs, which can be found in the field where their presence is marked with a music icon. Oh, you are kidding me. That's awesome. Well, I, I think for now, let's play our my favorite tune, Tifa's theme. We'll just enjoy that. Before we get on to money... There's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. <laughs> How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into wow, all this. It, it was, was wrong crazy. of me to put you in danger like I that. that I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. <laughs> so, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I love little shanty towns like this. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, it was bad. <laughs> oh, right. I just love how topical this is, too. Like, the news. And uh, here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Kind of controlling what people's perception is. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't oh. have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. Very convenient. Not even time to decorate. That's your room, and I'm staying right next to it. Huh. Strange. Here's your room, <laughs> 202. Don't worry. I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. All right. Thanks. It 
it's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... Uh-oh. That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. <laughs> Never mind. No. Two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> we got screwed. It's time for introductions. <laughs> is that supposed? <laughs> is that supposed to be a snore? Okay, so who's in this room then? So if if she was in the first one, we're in the second. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. It sounds Come like in. Barrett. That, uh, that number on his arm, too. I'm not sure what that means. What are you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad oh, guy. Oh, this guy. Whoa, okay. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. <sighs> See, this is where it's going to get crazy because we can't really tell what's real and what's not. Uh, he seems real. And now we just have a regular day in life. Probably used to having crazy nightmares. All right, nothing else going on. Let's go. Can we check on this guy again? Nope. Hello. Puff to Phoenix down. Always happy to have that. Place doesn't seem so bad in the daylight. Well, now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. <laughs> What's she to you? 
The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Doesn't even introduce us to the dog. Is your face always that pale? <laughs> You're not getting enough sleep. Okay. Thanks, Grandma. My husband decided to go. I just kind of want to see what else might be happening around here. Nothing of note. It's like some type of daycare, I guess. It might be a good idea to stock up on food before it's all gone. We'll end up at Seventh Heaven eventually. I'll just take the scenic route. Think we could get some money if we strip this thing for parts? Looks damn near rusted through to me. Yeah, what parts? You can't hide forever, Avalanche. You're going down. Avalanche did all these bad things. No, Avalanche are the good guys. If we yell that enough, it'll become true. Hey. Dinner at Seventh Heaven tonight. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could if Jesse put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. <sighs> Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? Fair point. <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. There's nothing worse than that rotten egg smell, that sulfur. Remember visiting Iceland? Go and we'd and smell that we quite a bit. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. As long as I get it all to Item shop. Today's special high potion. Oh, that's cool. I wonder if that actually changes. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby. How you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait. Let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. <laughs> huh? Nothing. Cloud! Uh... Since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. Okay, cool. So we have 1,548 gil, it seems. We could buy items and materia. Items, we can buy... Well, absolutely. We're going to buy every track that we can. The prelude. Potions, we have quite a few. Antidotes, we don't have any. We haven't seen any poison, but... Um... Let's, let's hold off on that for a sec. Let's see what kind of materia they have. So healing materia, we have fire, ice, uh, lightning, and deadly dodge. Uh, let's grab one of each that we don't have. Just to try to account for any uh, weaknesses that we might run into. Oh, here we can search for everything. Cool. Let's buy like, I don't know, five of these. In terms of selling, we had like an extra, uh, he only buys items and materia because we had an extra bangle, I believe, but we'll have to sell that to somebody else probably. And now Thanks. we're broke. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by, especially if Teeth is with you. Okay, simmer down. We'll see you around, okay? 
And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you could want, straight from the plate. He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, okay. maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please... I feel like we're going to be getting a lot of these reminders. So map-wise, uh, you can check your current scenario objective and view the lay of the land. Uh, can we zoom in here? Yes. Okay. So we are having things marked for us. Show relative to current position. Cool. Oh, this is nice too. I like when games do this. They include like small little summaries as to what happens. So we had a vision of Sephiroth. He eventually returns to his room, still reeling from the hallucinations as he awaits the dawn. Tifa, a childhood friend of Cloud, uses her connections to get him an apartment. After promising to help her with collections tomorrow, Cloud hits the sack. Down here than on the plate. Apparently it was done by a terrorist. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Maro. <laughs> She's spying from the dumpster. <laughs> Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh. What's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. You I'm mentioned. pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit. Big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Taking a break at rest spots recovers all your HP and MP. Rest spots include your own bed, blue benches next to vending machines, and other locations. All right. You'd better not cause Tifa any heartache. Holy, she's all over us. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. The watch is saying they're gonna step up now? their game. Five years, give wow. or take. Ain't they shorthanded? Uh, but never mind but that. We've all, gotta get you your money. Last stop is the weapon store. Well, that's grim. Oh, fiends slain this one. I thought that said friends slain this hey, month. But isn't Tifa? You here for the filter? <laughs> huh? Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! Jeez. All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barra be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. I like this as a way of getting to know all of the players. I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Oh, punk ass bitch. Really? No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. 
Come and check out our selection. Cool. Speak with our friendly staff to find I guess we'll try weapons later then. You and your needs. We gotta do something about the monsters. Oh, so what are you thinking? I'll head on down. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Gentlemen. Oh, hey Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh lots of stuff really but our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town that and teaching the locals how to defend themselves like they say the only one who will look out for you is you cloud's a great fighter but only we know that if no one knows him no one will hire him thought if he joined the watch he could get his name out there that would work for everybody truth be told we could really use your help we can't pay you in gill but we'll work something out Story of my life, buddy. For example, aha, uh -huh. what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on, at least let me show you how it's done. You can now enhance your weapons, uh, skill points to unlock. So, okay, spend SP or skill points to unlock special skills infused in weapons. You can enhance weapons and unlock weapon skills through upgrade weapons. First, select the character whose weapon you'd like to upgrade. Press X to select Cloud. The number to the right of each weapon is the max SP value, a value which increases as the characters level up. Okay, so when we level up, it goes into weapons. Next, select the the weapon you'd like to upgrade. Press X to select the Buster Sword. The number next to it is the amount of SP you can spend on that weapon. Whoa. Buster Sword Core. Unlock weapon skills and enhance your weapons. Weapon skills can be unlocked using skill points. Every weapon has its own SP pool. Use left or the direction pad to select weapon skills to unlock. Okay. So, magic attack power increases magic attack power attribute, increases maximum HP, increases attack power attribute, and fun or punisher mode, strong attack damage, 5% boost. I really like that. Um, okay, let's take an HP boost. And then we'll also take... You can just take a straight 5% attack power. Because we use that, we're like constantly smashing enemies with just regular attacks. And then the next two will probably go into the uh, Enhanced Punisher. If that makes sense. And it shows you which ones we've unlocked, which ones we haven't. Cool. You can automate SP allocation by selecting a weapon and pressing triangle to change your weapon upgrade settings. Select the setting that best accommodates your battle strategy. Unlocking skills has all kinds of beneficial effects, such as boosting weapon stats and increasing materia slots. When a character levels up and the max SP of their equipped weapon increases, that weapon also levels up. The higher the weapon level, the more types of weapon skills become available. This ends the tutorial. All right, cool. This is awesome. Um... So when you switch weapons, eventually, does everything kind of reset? I guess so. You'd be starting at the base of that weapon. Cool. Prioritize equip gear, wep weapon upgrade settings. So we can say manual, balance, prioritize attack, prioritize defense. Maybe with uh, other party members we do something like this, but for now we'll keep it on manual to have control. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Oh, for sure. Thanks. Huh. We'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. <laughs> I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No. I've got this. But 
You don't know the way, do you? <laughs> Lead on. Awesome. And plus, we'll probably get to uh, see what she brings to the table. Better than anyone. Awesome. Oh, cool. Okay. Neighborhood Watch, here we come. Guys, I think this is a good place to stop. Um, let's take a break here when we come back. Looks like we're going to be clearing out some monsters. I love the way that we're getting uh, introduced to everybody. I think it's really cool. Watch relies on residents' donations for funding. And uh, I'm having a blast. Just even though this kind of stuff is a little bit slower, this for me is like we get to know the characters. We get to know the area. Well, probably this is going to be like a central hub for a while, I imagine. Won't be anyone who doesn't know about the new Merc when we're through. Yeah, okay. Thanks, Wedge. And, uh, of course, Tifa here is... I can guarantee you she's going to get us into a lot of trouble. Anyways, uh, wish me luck. We'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you soon.